Welcome to KTG Hats run number three. My name is Kevin. This is my collection and I hope you love them. The new collection is getting incredible reviews. Everybody seems to be really thrilled with them. I'm, I don't even know where to begin. What we're going to do is just go through each model one by one and just let you know the difference between the different styles show you a few photographs and uh, hopefully you'll get the gist of what the collection is like it's pretty simple we're going to start off with our first hat uh, that we call the sky piece which is sort of like uh that's my style you can see it right there that's the sky piece the green one that you're familiar with you always see me wearing it it's a two and a half inch brim with a fairly narrow brim binding it's got matching brim binding to the band this is probably my favorite color right here. It's called Mist. It's a very, very light gray, like a light dove gray that almost looks like white, but it's not white. It's super, super light gray uh, with a charcoal gray that almost has little bits of brown tones. The green obviously is a huge seller. It looks great. It's one of those hats that's an eye catching. It's almost like a Tiffany green. Um, it's sort of like my trademark hat, I love it. And there's the mist next to it. Uh, the mist is definitely one of my best, best designs, I think, to the date. Although I've sold a lot of these green hats, uh, I still feel the mist is one of my most successful designs. It just looks perfect. Just look at that. You could wear it in the, in the fall, in the autumn, in the spring. It's nice and soft. With these hats, the fur felt gets softer, the lighter the color. This is a brand new color called Sapphire. Sapphire has a sky blue ribbon. It's not a typical navy blue. This is a navy that really looks like navy. It doesn't look like black. It's a beautiful blue. It's great if you've got blue eyes especially. And it's got an icy blue trim. Now these are two new colors. That's deep purple and camel trimmed with black. Those two colors are very rare. They're not gonna be around for long. This might be the very last of the deep purple. We'll see how it goes, if we could get more of that felt. It's trimmed with black. So is the camel, it's also trimmed with the one and a quarter inch black. But if you notice, there's a new color now. That's ash gray on the bottom of it with sky blue trim. Now I don't have a photo of it because it doesn't exist. So let's move on to the next hat which is called the galaxy the galaxy is probably our most popular model right now we're getting more orders for this than anything you can see it's got super wide brim binding on it which is something that i saw on some vintage hats but i've never seen it on a modern hat before a lot of companies are afraid to do it um, we're not afraid to do it this is our biggest color it's called dark olive if you notice it's a very neutral olive it's almost a little charcoal-y, kind of a dark, dark olive, but it is it is indeed green. This is a new color, just plain old gray, ash gray with black, which is a color I've been meaning to do. It's gonna look fantastic with that thick binding. There's one more color, gunmetal, which is charcoal gray with a silver belly cream binding. There's no photos of this yet, unfortunately, just this computer mock-up. But um, there it is. We're the only ones who do a hat like this with big, wide binding. Um, it also comes in an open crown version too. There's, as you can see, there's an open crown uh, version with a two inch ribbon called the Premier version. Okay, now if you don't like the binding, we do it with a raw edge too. We don't call that the Galaxy. It turns into a different name. It's called the Nostalgia. So figure the same crown four and a half inch uh, teardrop, which is like a whippet style teardrop, same specs. We do it in four colors with a raw edge too. So that's the galaxy without the brim binding is called the nostalgia. We do nostalgia in the white navy. It's like a sapphire navy, it really stands out. We do it in the dark olive. It's got a real adventurer type of look to it. You could do it in open crown also. The Nostalgia Premier looks really like a, an indie type hat. Here's the Premier. Premier has a big high open crown and a two inch ribbon. We can only fit the two inch ribbon on the open crown. So this hat comes unshaped, you shape it yourself. Comes just open like a bowl. And uh, look at that. 
So that's the mist with the sapphire band with a two inch band. We're just doing the new generations now with a two inch ribbon. Uh, I wasn't exactly sure if I was gonna go for it, but you can see the two inch does work. It's just a very exaggerated vintage type of a look. It's not for everybody, but if you're a vintage guy and you wanna go full out, shape it yourself, uh, most people find that it's very easy to shape. Uh, you don't even need steam, just give it a crease, pinch it, and you're set. That's the Nostalgia Premier, the open crown version of the Nostalgia. Okay, it comes in mist, camel, dark olive, and ash gray with Merlot. This color came out fantastic. We're actually getting a lot of orders for that, uh, the gray with the burgundy Merlot trim. I don't even know which is my favorite. They're all my favorite. You're gonna find that all four colors on this style look incredible. Whether you get the teardrop or the open crown premiere version, it's one of the most amazing hats. All four colors are just incredible. There's the camel and the premiere, two inch ribbon. We're doing this coloration now in the nostalgia premiere, but not in the galaxy anymore. Look at the, somebody made a uh, diamond crease. This is done with no steam, just with the hands. So if you like shaping it yourself, you've got the Nostalgia Premier in four colors or the Galaxy with the brim binding in three colors. Okay, look, to the left there, that's even a Sky Piece Premier. Somebody ordered a purple Sky Piece, a deep purple and open crown. That can be done. In any of our hats, just add the word Premier. See what he did? He made it into like an open road cattleman crease type of thing. So there's the world's first purple Sky Piece Premier. Okay, let's go to the New Yorker. This is our three inch brim hat with a periwinkle band. This one does have brim binding, but the brim binding matches the felt. So that's blue felt with blue brim binding. So I call that invisible brim binding. It, the brim just has a little ribbon trim on it, but it's the same color as the felt, so it's hard to see. It just gives it a little bit of a clean, polished edge. The, uh, the whitish color, the mist with the sapphire band was incredible. Uh, I think it might be my favorite style of the entire run. This is the sapphire with periwinkle. Look at that, that's the mist. The mist edge and the special bow. This is a bow that I invented. I took it off a, a different style. I kind of stole it from a different hat, but uh, that's the KG, KG, KTG bow on the Mist New Yorker. It's a big three inch brim. Fantastic hat for ladies or for men. Little bit of extra brim is just so elegant. Take a risk and try a New Yorker. I think you'll love it. Uh, the New Yorker is available in this colorway now, the dark olive with the taupe color, although there's no pictures of it yet. Um, it's the third color. So if you'd like a three inch brim in this colorway, it will be available. Okay, here's the comet. This is my shorter brim hat. It's not a short brim, but just a little bit shorter. So it's a two and a quarter inch brim with a raw edge. Okay, think about a two and a half, but a little shorter. Two and a quarter inches and a really nice brim size. It's very authentic and it's very overlooked. You don't see a lot of people making them. See how it looks? It's just a little neater. It's not as showy or as flashy. It's a real like a gentlemanly look. It still has enough brim, you know, to cover your eyes and to look a little, uh, you know, incognito and stuff, but it's, it's just neater. Um, I'm doing these in four colors. We've got the olive taupe up on top. To the left there is ash gray with crystal. It's almost a light, light, light gray, dove gray. And then on the bottom there is cadet blue, which is just like a pale navy with a deeper navy band. There you go. It's got the KTG 30s bow style on it. That's the Comet, two and a quarter inch bow. Looks a lot like a Sterling, uh, very similar to an old hat called the Bob, B-O-B, -B, that we used to sell about 15 years ago. I just wanted to bring this style back. There's the Ash on the left, Ash with crystal trim and cadet blue with navy. Okay, the Satellite, that's a brand new hat that doesn't exist yet. It has a, somewhat of an Alessandria or a, a road style band. So on the left is the Satellite, which has a, a four and a half inch teardrop, like a Whippet style teardrop. It comes in silver belly, brown coffee there with cream trim, or in the olive with taupe. 
Now on the top right is a starlight. It's the same hat, open crown. So if you'd like an open crown version of the satellite, we call it the starlight. So there is no satellite premiere because the band doesn't change. It's not really a premiere package. It's just an open crown satellite. We changed the name to the starlight. So if you like open crown, it's starlight. If you like a teardrop, it's the satellite. Two different hats, same trim, pretty much the same specs everywhere else except the crown. One's open, one's a teardrop. Um, it's got a very nice ribbon. It doesn't hang on the brim like an open road, so it doesn't curl up. It's nice and neat. Okay, how to order? Just PayPal me the payment. There it is up there to Quadragon. I just need the model, the color, the size, and your shipping information. Uh, send that to me right in the PayPal app or just email it to me separately, doesn't matter. Generally, your address is already in PayPal. You could skip that if it's there. Uh, but if it's getting shipped to a different address, you know, give me that different address so I know where to ship it to. Okay, uh, you can send me two payments of one forty-two fifty. One would be due now to reserve your hat, and the second payment is due within about two, two months. Basically, uh, any time before your hat is shipped, Generally, we'll figure two, sometimes three months for the whole build time, and that's it. Uh, don't wait till the last minute, otherwise it might delay your shipping. Uh, our hats come in every size, all the way from 55 to 64, a full size 8. They run very true to size. Uh, anybody in the United States, continental U.S. gets free shipping. I'm going to pay that shipping, actually. And uh, also, if you're a Quebec resident, Quebec City resident, let me know. You will also get free shipping. Anybody else, um, we do ship everywhere in the world. It can get a little expensive going to like, you know, Taiwan was, uh, you know, about 106 bucks for you guys. But um, you figure it's going to be up there. It could be from 75 up to about 105, depending where you live. Uh, but uh, it is indeed free shipping for anybody in the continental U.S. or in Quebec. Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching. This is Kevin. Uh, if you'd like to stay in touch with me and everything I've been doing, please join our new Facebook group called Hats and Guitars. Show your hats. It's a cool place to just show your cool hats, meet nice people, and uh, learn a few things. Thank you.